How do you thin cyanoacrylate? Have you ever wondered how to make super glue less thick and easier to use? Today, we will talk about thinning cyanoacrylate, a fascinating topic in the world of chemistry. Cyanoacrylate is a type of adhesive commonly known as super glue. It is a fast-acting polymer that cures quickly when it comes into contact with moisture. This process occurs through a mechanism called anionic polymerization. Thinning cyanoacrylate can be quite useful, especially when you need it to flow better or penetrate into small gaps. To do this, you need to reduce its viscosity, making it less thick and more fluid. However, it is important to do this carefully to avoid triggering premature polymerization. So, how do you thin cyanoacrylate effectively? The key is to use the right solvents. You want to choose organic solvents that do not contain moisture or reactive species that could start the curing process. Acetone is a popular choice for thinning cyanoacrylate. It dissolves the adhesive and reduces its thickness without, causing immediate polymerization. Other solvents like ethyl acetate or methyl ethyl ketone can also work, but you should use them cautiously. When thinning cyanoacrylate, it is crucial to avoid any water or moisture. Since cyanoacrylate cures rapidly in the presence of moisture, any solvent you use must be anhydrous, meaning it is free from water. This will help prevent the adhesive from curing too soon during the thinning process. Another important factor to consider is concentration control. You need to be careful about how much solvent you add. If you dilute it too much, you could weaken the adhesive strength and change the curing time. If you are working in an industrial setting, you might encounter practices that involve using inhibitors. These can include acidic gases or phenolic compounds that help prevent premature polymerization while handling and thinning the cyanoacrylate. Thin cyanoacrylate can be especially helpful for bonding porous materials or tight-fitting parts. A thinner adhesive layer allows for better penetration and more uniform bonding. Keep in mind that once you thin cyanoacrylate, it may have a shorter shelf life. It can polymerize faster due to increased exposure to air or moisture. Therefore, proper storage in airtight containers is essential to maintain its effectiveness. In summary, thinning cyanoacrylate involves using organic solvents like acetone while ensuring the environment is dry. This process modifies the adhesive's viscosity, making it easier to work with while still maintaining its bonding properties.